USD cat now we we are based on daily chart okay as we can see based on the daily chart now we want to see whether this is a correction for the one move down or this is the start of the up move because we as we can see this candle is in compared to the rest is quite sharp all right we move to forward chart based on the forward chart also all right again is since we have a correction here can we say this is the only correction in relative to the this move okay and it can be this one can be the start of the up move uh, sorry this one or again just as we say we can expect the one this this is the correction in relative to this for the next move down all right now the thing is whether we should look for the up move or down move but since we have this correction with this sharp move mostly we if we get a buy setup we can look for buy because we don't see any information that price can drop but before that we need to highlight that if this correction become co more complex or even within this correction there is a possibility that the sharp price can drop that's mean if we look for buy we should have the proper management at least uh, a stop loss okay for example we don't want to what happen here repeat all right in this case we want we move to one hour chart uh, we see how we can trade it all right as we can see we have a correction here no the things is shall we wait the price drop we get a co correction then we get the buy setup within this range we look for buy or having entry above this all right as what we have right now this correction already is like complete at, it's not a complete at least can be a correction for the up move all right but the things is the price is at the top already how we can trade the only way we can trade is that having entry above this okay but this having entry above this we should expect the sharp move if the price come and tag reverse we take out okay this is a quite risky and uh, I don't suggest because uh, as we say the, the possibility the price come tag and reverse okay but okay, one of the option it depends on the traders whether they can trade they have the experience for that or not but if the price drop come to somewhere around this level then from there if we get any buy setup we look for buy that's me from the co this correction what we have we are looking for the up move all right but we need to get the buy setup how we trade it it depends okay that's why we wait when the price drop then from there if we get the buy setup we trade and any trade should be with the stop loss because how about if we get a correction here the first analysis that we say may this is the in relative to this for the next move down this one is correct then how at least we we can uh, have a I mean we have a stop loss and we know how to manage it all right okay if we want to look for buy shall we have a stop loss below this all right it depends where we get the trade if we're going to have entry above this I think it's best is having a stop loss below this but if we want to look for the down move we see how we take the trade even it depends on the traders even they want to have a trade below this as long as the sorry a stop loss below this as long as they get the trade move into this profit we move our stop loss to below this it depends how deep this one can how how much this one can drop right now the, the lowest is here if it drop lower then we put there all right regarding the uh, stop loss we need to see how this correction can form after the price drop all right then uh, the reason is we're talking about the stop loss is that I don't want to we get the trade then suddenly the sharply price reverse okay anyway we just follow the chart and see how we can trade it if we see any proper trade setup rather than having a trade above this above the top then uh, we i will share in the group thanks